do. So just get back to change your intention. Just look at what eating should be something that it's, is a gift. Have a different attention to it. Eat more natural. Make sure that your nerve supply is getting, because you're not eating, you're amped out. You're not eating just because you're stressed. Make sure you're in proper alignment, that you're sitting up nice and straight. Look at the air that you're putting in your, your body. Be out in nature more. If you're inside a lot, get in a, in a, uh, some of the inside air filters that they have. You got to look at some nutrients that you might want to put into your body. You got to look at timing. So if you're uh, eating foods that are high processed, get more greens into your body. Get more your omega-3 oils, which we don't even have in our diet anymore because we have taken and processed so many foods. And the last letter, E, stands for your environment. We as a society are actually destroying more of our environment on a day-to-day -day basis. And if you look at, just say, the rainforests that are being destroyed for cattle farming, if you look at the size of uh, uh, entire states over a week, the, in the whole rainforest being destroyed, and the oxygen that those trees make to create an environment for our own ozone. And we wonder why we have this global warming effect and how that affects different storm systems. Our cells are a microcosm of the Earth. Our cells have to work in harmony for the organs to work properly, for our body to work properly. You, as an individual, need to look at having the proper intention for your own family. Look and see what you're putting in your kids so they're not being uh, injected with Ritalin or given some other antibiotic because their body is so toxic and, and full of yeast from the sugars and, and we just keep doing that so that we actually suppress our immune system. And then we want to get inject them with more and more medications and more and more uh, vaccinations. We've gotten so far off track. Pharmaceutical companies are trying to create more and more drugs for more and more conditions because we just by what we do to our body on a day-to-day -day basis, what we put into our body, how we uh, plan our days to reduce stress is, is absolutely critical. We want you to become healthier. As chiropractors, we want our patients to be in alignment. And this topic today was really about getting your nutrition back in alignment. So I want you to just take one thing that we talked about here. You know, whether it's just having a better attention, plan out a seven-day diet and, and just take one meal a day and make it a little bit healthier. Add more greens. You know, get proper natural foods. Make sure your nerve supply, get a spinal checkup, proper air, proper timing, and look and see how that actually does affect your, your environment. You know, I appreciate you taking the time to watch the show. Please put one thing in, in uh, play because next week you'll become healthier than you are this week. Until next time, we'll see you later from A Touch of Health. I'm Dr. Bob Grakowski. Thank you. something.